to answer your question, is canned beans, like, is it edible to drink the, well, not drink the, eat the liquid? Or is it, you know, something else? Well, I'm gonna answer that question for you real quick. Yes, it is totally edible. It's usually a citrus acid or a vinegar that's helping it to, you know, not get bacteria such as botulism. Usually when they put it in a can, they, they grab the beans, it's rehydrated, they've cooked it, they add in citrus acid or a vinegar to get it to a 4.6 because you want to have it underneath that point unless it's a naturally acidic food, then all you have to do is pasteurize it. So you've cooked it, you put it in the can, you've canned it all up, then you have to pasteurize it. And pasteurize is, it depends on the temperature there's pasteurized, super pasteurized, ultra pasteurized, and each one of them just means higher temperature but boiling water, but you cool it down rapidly. So it's totally safe. And the point of pasteurized is to stop botulism from happening, to kill off spores from growing because it doesn't need oxygen. So there's that. The answer to the question, yeah, it's totally edible. I, I throw it in my, my food all the time, and maybe sometimes you don't want that off flavor, so, and that's okay. All you need to do is just rinse it out real quick, put it into a strainer, and, and that's it. But for me, I've never had that problem. I don't really care. I always throw that flavor in there because it's good flavor, because it's just vinegar or citrus acid, which is totally fine. Unless you are trying to not have that high acidic food, that's what's gonna happen. You're, you're taking away that pH of 4.6 away and maybe you're trying to do a high alkaline you know diet food or you're you don't you want to balance out your food by not having too much uh, acidity because imagine you know you're doing peppers and then all of a sudden you're doing a lemon and orange and then you're adding this canned stuff now you're just having a very acidic dish that you're about to consume which is going to have acid reflexes because a person like myself I have that happen to me because if I've had too much acidity food, I'm like, oh, I had coffee this morning. Oh, okay, I just had salsa. Oh, okay, now I'm about to have this canned food. What's going to happen? I have acid reflux. All right, hope that answers your question. I'm Chef Nicholas Canadian. Don't forget to click the like button. This helps more than you know. If you have any other questions, I do want to mention that uh, underneath there are some links for you to actually, you know, read more in, of course, you know, the Wikipedia and the facts you need to know about canning process so you know a little more how it works and so it makes you feel more comfortable and realize that, no, nope, a lot of this stuff is actually safe. Okay, peace.